Hi, welcome back to my channel. We are currently in a different filming location because today it's going to rain and it's really dark over by the front door and I have my light on for my house plants and so I thought I would film here. I apologize for the look of my table. It is not the cleanest looking, but it is what it is. In front of you today is the Savvy Bee Planner. It's a non-dated planner. It's a quarterly planner. So it's gonna last you three months. I purchased this from Amazon because I have a gift card, had a gift card um, for my brother for my birthday. And so I went ahead and bought this. So it arrived in this box. So you pulled it out from the top. It arrived in a crinkly package like this. So when I pulled out the planner, it also came the crinkly bag which I pulled out. It also arrived with this little booklet and then it came with these two cards and then let me quickly flip through this. So the first page is about commitment, affirmations, and then you can read this and then it will help you fill out the planner. It talks about your vision. There's a vision board. There's a monthly view, a weekly view, and a daily view. So let me set this aside. It's a hard cover book. This is the front of the page. So you would fill this out. A quote, you would put your name on top. You would sign it after you read this. your affirmations, your vision for your life, how will you get there and the required steps, goals to achieve, three. This is where you would create your vision board. Now here is your monthly, uh, the start of your monthly layout. So it's blank. Uh, you have a section here for your habits, three goals, your big wins, what you've learned for the month. Over here on the side, you would put things to do, places to go, people to see. And then right here, you would check off your habits as you do them daily. And then your focus for the month. Now you get six um, months, six layout, monthly layouts. And then uh, there are ribbons. So the next ribbon would be to your weekly page and you have enough weekly pages to last you three months because again this is a quarterly planner you will not get a full year so the weekend date would be up here your focus for the week or your main goal for the week you would put right here five steps to achieve it your top goals and priority I will escape my comfort zone learn something new you have a column for your perfect week, things to avoid for your career, your body, your relationships, personal. Uh, your notes will go down here. And then let's flip over to your daily page. And again, you will have enough daily pages to last you um, the quarter, three months. So here you would write the day and the date I am grateful for, I am excited about, today I will focus on. Then you would write down your goals and priorities for the day and he gives you four. You would write down your tasks over here and then check them off as you go. Your schedule, your daily schedule will be right here from six in the morning to night at night. Every day there is a daily quote and it's different every day. This is a section for your notes end of the day review so you've completed blank out of blank daily habits your daily wins and then set an intention for tomorrow and then at the back there are some note pages and then in the very very back in the back of the book there are stickers there's a pocket right here and there are stickers inside and I think you get five sheets so here's one Two, three, 
four, five, and I like the pocket in the back, pretty handy. So we'll slide this back in. You will receive uh, a couple of days after you buy the journal. I bought this on Amazon for $24.97. I can't remember if I said that. You will receive for free three ebooks that the seller will send to you. And uh, what else? I think that's it. Um, again, I am not affiliated with this company. I bought this with my own money because I do feel that this is worth its value. And um, yeah, I think that's it. So this is the Savvy B non-dated daily planner. I plan to start using this in January because for me, my quarter has already started. We're in the fourth quarter and I feel it's going to be wasteful if I were to start using this now because then I would have a month um, not used. Um, so I plan on using this in January. So I may show this planner again in January to show you the planners that I plan on using for the year of 2022. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Subscribe if you are interested in, I guess, seeing how I use this planner next month or next year, as well as the after the pin flip throughs that I do of my Hobonichi Techo, as well as my Happy Planner. So thank you for watching, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.